Halloween queens or holla queens? Oh, I did not come up with that. That was my good old friend Xavier. Here's his Twitter handle. Follow him. He's funny. Also, today we're going to be doing Frankenstein. But a girl Frankenstein, so it's going to be cute and not ugly. But for this, I'm actually not using any foundation. I'm painting myself green. I hate paint, but I'm doing it for you guys. All right, so if you want to see this look, stay tuned. Going in with this green paint that I got at Party City, you can see we thought it was going to be thick, but it turns out to be pretty sheer. Um, I tried to put multiple layers down, but it really didn't matter because it just, it was just sheer. There's even parts where the more I put down, the, like, it just took Prada off. Oh, make sure to cover your ears. And your neck, of course. You see? So I tried to put some on top, but nope, doesn't work. Decided to go in with this green eyeshadow to set it all down and get some more color. I just put that all over my face. And don't forget to blend it all the way down your neck. Going in with this grayish charcoal color, I'm going to use it as a weird contour to chisel these cheeks out. So I put it in all my contour areas, making sure to, you know, get my chin. And this is our first layer of white eyeshadow. We're basically baking with white eyeshadow every step because I want my under eyes to look a little lighter. So yeah, put it in all of your highlighted areas. And this is big number one. Now going in with the same green color, I'm just putting it on my lid and blending it out with the same charcoal. And then I add a black on top to make it smoky. I take that all the way down my, you know, lower line and bake fresh again. <laughs> going in with the Galaxy palette by Rihanna, going with this pretty green. I put some, you know, spritz my finger and look at how pretty that is. Can you tell me? That is gorgeous. Going in with that one. I put that in the inner corners. And then I bake again. <laughs> As you can see, the palette has a bit of fallout. But, you know, we can work with it. This is Later Crater. Also from the new line. And I am in love with this eyeliner. I am in love with this eyeliner. Look at that. I love the color. Something about the color just makes me so into it. But now we're going to go in and draw our baseline for our stitches. So this is basically the pattern I'm using. I'm going to draw another one on my cheek. It's kind of parallel to my contour and then I draw like a diamondy shaped one. And ba bam. Now we're going to fill in these lips. I don't know why I filled in my lips like this. I was just kind of feeling it. It's more like a Disney cartoon character than anything else, but it worked at the end. Now we're just going to put down our sewing lines for where our stitches go. We're going to create, this is kind of like the shadow of where the lines go. And I'm going to put that over each line. Now we go in with white, you know, my trusty white highlighter to underline things and create more of the shadow on the stitchings. So I'm just putting it like on one side of the black dot. It doesn't matter which side, I'm just putting it on there. I didn't realize until I was editing that I didn't put a white line across my forehead. But it kind of worked. I like it. So 
you can you have the choice either put the white line across your forehead or not I just didn't because I guess I didn't remember <laughs> and now going back into the later crater we're gonna draw in our stitches in a cross fashion It's literally like right here that I realized, wait, I have no white under my under my little forehead gash. And I was like, I guess it works. And now we're gonna go in with this re hyper glitz lipstick in Scifly, and then this is Gal on the Moon lip gloss on top. Now I'm just going to fill in my brows. I'm using my Sephora eyeliner and I'm literally just mimicking the hairs of my brows. I'm not blocking them or anything. I'm literally just filling them in like how I would to make them look as natural as possible but with black eyeliner. And here are the slow-mos. Alrighty guys, that's the look. This glam AF Frankenstein's bread. Or wife, or just Frankenstein, or I don't know. Lady with stitches. Whatever you want to call her. This is number 18. <laughs>